So I've wanted to make a leather shop apron for a while now and decided this would be the perfect time. Here you can see me cutting out the outline following an old uh, denim apron that I had that fit me quite well. Here it is fully cut out and I'm just now gluing the edges to prepare for stitching. So I spread the glue along the seams, along the edges, and then fold it all in just so I have a nice clean edge for the final, uh, final apron. And I repeat this process for the entire apron, smoothing, gluing, and then smoothing again. This process was actually quite tedious and took uh, around a full day's work. Uh, the entire apron actually took a total of around four days here you can see me punching the stitching holes as I prepare to stitch that folded edge uh, permanently. The thread I was using was actually um, called B50 Dacron and it's used for the making of bowstrings for archery. Um, the total stitching time for the entire apron took around 8 hours as it was about 3 minutes for every inch of stitch. Here you can see me cutting out the front pocket. I wanted a design that was quite minimalist, just able to hold all of the tools that I will be using every single day. Here I've finally stitched the entire thing and I'm just burning the edges so that it is fully locked in. I then smoothed over the stitched edge just to make sure everything was flush and then proceeded to punch more holes to stitch the front pocket to the body of the apron. After that, I then riveted the shoulder straps in place, and I wanted to use metal clasps to secure the shoulder straps just to make it a little bit more quick for me to take on and off. So here you can see me cutting some small leather strips and fixing them to a metal keyring, and then riveting that in place onto the actual body of the apron. I am now punching the final hole for the actual shoulder straps and riveting the final length into place. And here are some photos for you. The actual pocket was quite large and I wanted to put in some dividers to keep everything more organized. So here I'm punching more holes to stitch the dividers into place. And here it is completed. Uh, it fits a machinist ruler, a X-Acto knife, a Sharpie, and of course my cell phone, all of which are tools that I'll use basically every single day in the workshop. And uh, yeah, I think it came out pretty good, so I'm excited to put it to use.